lean yet. May we not see that the accused person has pleaded guilty simplicity. He has admitted his guilt. You know, he has relieved the state of the burden of having to prosecute him. You know, look at his demeanor as he appears before him. What else can a man be remorseful as this accused person may not? Now, convict has shown and demonstrated to this honorable court. You know, it is very unfortunate that from the fact this is a person who is married, children. You know, the question is what else can occasion the conduct of such a person? You know, this is one thing that you can attribute to the work of the devil. But well, clearly the devil is at work. Otherwise, well, there is not there is nothing no rational reason why a person who is married with three wives, well, eight kids, some of which are of the same age, will not ask the victim. Well, we won't see much. We will pray the honorable court to, to look at the remorseful nature demonstrated by the accused person who is now a convict, the fact that he has relieved the state of the burden to prosecute him and pray that my Lord will temper justice with mercy. My Lord, please deal with the accused person being in But I hope that your Lordship will be my granny was to this prayer. I humbly submit. <laughs> Honorable counsel, you have spoken beautifully. However, cases of defilement are on the ascendancy, especially in this area. A married man with three wives And allowing his libido to push him to go and defile a 13 year old girl whose age is like some of the ages of his own children. Uh, you are telling us uh, is the work of the devil. Can you help us to locate the devil so that we deal with it? We cannot allow the devil to rise above the society and push people into doing things that they should not do. Help us to locate the devil. We know, we know, we know the greatest of respect to the honorable court. We know the devil is always in the details. We know the devil is always in the details. Unfortunately, my lord, we are confronted with a situation where we did not go into the details of this matter. The accused has pleaded guilty simplicity. We know the discretion to sentence the accused person is now solely in your bosom. And we pray, your lordship. That you be so magnanimous to the accused person. But I don't think it is something that he is going to ever repeat, looking at his demeanor as he appears before you. My Lord, please tamper justice with mercy. I pray accordingly. I have tampered justice with mercy. I should have given him the maximum sentence, which is 25 years. <laughs> But upon the plea of mitigation, I reduce it to 20 years. So take him off. He sentenced to 20 years. We are most obliged. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
so unfortunate. Now you got me now. Go on. I'm still going on the page. It's actually confirmed that. Uh, not your wish you would have been with us forever. Right? But the, the knowledge in the world that he has. Uh, but you could even see the donation by my tone has just gone down. But I'm actually sad. Very sad. Because we lost a very good answer. We are all very sad. We are all very sad. <laughs> Lawyer Damina knew his law. He will come to confide and assemble the genius around him and guide them through the cases that they have gone and you know, arbitrated upon. It's so sad. He knew his order from order one of CI 47. From order one to order 81, he knew everything. He could tell you, but if you wanted to do matrimonial cases, you had to consult order 66. Macbeth said, Tomorrow and tomorrow and tomorrow creeps in this petty pace from day to day to the last syllable of recorded time, and all our yesterdays have lighted truths, the way to dusty death. Out, out, brief candle, lies but his walking shadow that's stress and fresh. Is uh, upon the stage and then is heard no more. It is a tale told by an idiot full of sound and fury, signifying nothing. Uh, we all want to believe that which lawyer Yahweh at the helm of a face here. He will guide all the lawyers to take notes and care for their health. Where well, your man likes his beer. But he was very friendly. He has lived his time. <sighs> I, I have nothing more to say. Uh, but um, uh, shall we say, may his soul rest in perfect peace. But I don't the remaining cases. Since today is a very bad day for all of us. I remember saying to you, yeah, it is. Hey, I didn't know. I didn't uh, before we do that, shall we give a minute silence? We shall all stand up for a minute.
Now it's going to be our permission to rise the court for what we've done for children in the news that we have heard this morning. Yeah. Thank you, Sister Lucy. It's okay with me. All right. We have sorry. We have sorry. What do you want? Sorry.